Being a musician, guitarist, teacher, producer, all those things I do, I use so many stuff on a regular basis that I just take for granted. Stuff I never really mention because it's just always there. I talk about gear a lot whenever I got something new, something very exciting or something special, but it's the everyday stuff that makes life better. So in this video, I wanna shine some light on the stuff I really love to use. And let's start with the first one. So when I found out this even existed, I was over the moon. So the worst sound since the beginning of the electric guitar is probably, we can all relate. Ugh. Especially having taught guitar for so many years, it amazed me how often students just pulled out the cables of their guitar. But what if I told you there is a solution to all that misery? Totally silent. So these Klotz jack cables have noiseless plugs. So even when your acoustic is plugged in on stage, there's a 30 minute break. You can safely plug out the cable without making any noise or switching guitars when you're plugged into your amp. No need for standby, just plug it out and switch the guitars, super handy. Okay, next up. So when I got this, I was like, okay, cool. I got tools, but in the end I used almost every week. It's a guitar toolkit. And this one is made by Harley Benton. It's very affordable, um, but there are some nice tools in there for DIY guitar maintenance. Setting up your action, truss rods, pickup height, changing strings, pick arts, whatever. The tool is there from pliers to Allen keys and screwdrivers and bits. It even came with a capo, a ruler, feeler gauges for super accurate guitar setup. I mean, who doesn't want this? It is beautiful. All right. Great stuff. Next up, number three. So mobile phones these days are pretty much everything you need, but when recording music or your guitar, the built-in microphone lacks some serious quality. It's shrill, often you hear the scraping of the pick better than the actual guitar, right? At least when you're not miming. <laughs> when you wanna capture a high-end quality on your phone, Shure has a nice little mic that lets you do that. So this is the Shure MV88 nice little package and this one connects to lightning to your Apple or iPhone device in this case but I'm actually waiting for a USB-C device to be delivered to my door but it didn't make it on time for this video I mean it's holiday season got the postman some slack so I'm super excited to use that particular version with my phone because that one has USB-C as well but I used this particular one for recording some videos when I was on the go it's super handy also for Instagram recording some quick ideas or even video production or music recording it gets the job done, it's a super nice quality. So there's that. Off to number four, my number one tip for more practice time is putting your guitar inside. But we don't want it to tip over, fall flat on the ground and end up like this. That actually happened to my last ball. It broke my soul, I'm still crying. But since then, I've been a big fan of these stands. You see, you can lock your guitar in and it just locks itself in there. It's super handy. It's made by Hercules and it more than once saved my ass when I stumbled either on my cable or someone bumped against my guitars on stage. It's a real life, uh, it's, a, it's a real guitar saver. So, awesome. Next up, let's dive in the realm of ones and zeros. So one thing I use for every video, every song I make, but it isn't very often featured on the channel is Ableton Live. It's a so-called DAW digital audio workstation. I record the audio for my videos I make into it. My vocals and guitars go on separate tracks so I can make the audio as crisp as possible. Also when I make a song, a track, live looping, gear demos, it's always recorded into that program. If you're interested in any way of making music or recording guitars or vocals, my suggestion is to look into this program. There's three versions three intro standard and suite ranging from 80 to 500 euros but for all goes there's a 30-day free trial so maybe it's fun to try out more software up to number six whenever i talk about transcribing stuff i always use guitar pro it's a program that allows you to quickly write down tabs or notation and play it back via midi which is a good way to check if it's actually correct what you've written down. So here is what I made for the how to play blues video. I wrote down the tab of what I'm playing in this program and usually I put the tabs over at my Patreon page. So Guitar Pro is very easy if you wanna transcribe stuff and notate it as well. So 
sometimes stuff just goes too fast, right? Exactly, so that is where number seven comes in. This is an amazing program that will help us with everything. So remember CDs? Rewinding was impossible. Or you can't hear what's being played because it goes way too fast. So to make it easy transcribing music, licks, or something from a video, I always, yeah, really all, well, like almost always, use this program called Transcribe. It lets you loop, slow down, transpose, or do whatever you want to the music. So this is a real life changer for making it easy to nail even the weirdest bits. So here's a part for my blues video. Slow it down, for example. Loop certain parts. Transpose it. And the most bizarre thing is that it can even identify notes or chords by itself. So if you're in doubt, you just select a part. So here we just see two notes, an E and an A. So great stuff, super handy tool for figuring stuff out by ear. Um, next up, so I don't know really where to put the next piece of gear. So I figured I'd just put it in this list. And if you want to see a full review, just let me know in the comment section. So I've been playing with a regular camper for three years. And if I had known this unit would come out, that would save me a lot of trouble. I was running the floor remote alongside with the camper, which is a hassle for bringing extra pedals. It requires long cables running from and to the unit. So this is a very handy all-in-one solution. You can hook pedals directly into the thing. It's all there. And the size, this unit is almost as big as just a remote by itself. Just look at the difference. And it has some sweet LEDs, perfect for live gigs. Amazing stuff. Up to number nine. This is something I really use every day. And it's a tuner. <laughs> yep, and a very nice one that is. So I got this from a student of mine the last day of teaching. And since then I've used it more than anything else. I used to do it with my phone, but to be honest, I just hate tuning with my phone, I don't know. And although we know that a guitar is never really 100% in tune, getting somewhat close is pretty sweet. So this one works with vibrations, so also in a very noisy environment. It gets the job done accurately. And it even does all the same strings at the same time. It automatically flips the screen when you turn it upside down. And the battery life is A+. So thanks Martijn, that was a great gift. <laughs> so number 10, the last one of the list but very important. So you saw, you saw me do it in my recent video, giving my baby some love. So this is a set of three different bottles. One for the finish, one to do it all, and one for the wood, so for the fretboard, for example. So it's a guitar care set and some cloths, which is very handy. So especially when recording a video, a guitar with dirty prints or grime all over the fretboard just doesn't look very appealing. So I make sure I try to clean it whenever I change strings, for example, or wipe down when I record a video, so the guitar looks at its best. Also taking care of the fretboard or the wooden parts is very important to make sure the wood stays in a good condition and they can be of use to you for many, many years to come. <laughs> just to say, this stuff is not sponsored by any means, it's just stuff I really like to use, so there's that. Thank you all so much for watching, have a nice holidays, and let's do some chilling as well. Don't forget to enjoy some time with the family, as well as with the guitars. Time for everything. Uh, have a wonderful day and thank you so much for watching. Cheers.